Well, hey, ladies and gentlemen, let's play Keonkyo Alien. It's Kyoto, what was once known as Hyankyo. He's been invaded by aliens. You were the Kabishi. Your job? You don't know how to kill aliens, but you do know how to bury things alive. Start digging. Step one, dig hole. Step two, bury alien. Step three, drink. That is how you solve an alien invasion. So we met the standard alien. In this level, we'll have our first super alien. Yep, there he is. They move differently. When two aliens... Well, when an alien falls into a hole and another alien touches it, it gets free of the hole. So bury them quickly. Like so. If you leave them in the hole too long, they'll break out. You can't dig on the uh, metal tiled floors, and the ones that phase in and out are lanterns. You can only go through those when they're open, or pale, or whatever. To trap an alien, all you have to do is dig a hole. What did Mel Gibson think of this, huh? He's not so smart, is he? Dance. Dance now. Dig and dance. It's good to gradually take their area away. waiting involved. And a lot of burying alive to do. This is one of those weird little video games I got when I was young. Alright, four aliens, new layout. Helps to have some running space, just in case the aliens free each other. It also helps to stand on a lantern, so they can't get you half the time. Alright, you little alien jerk, get over here. Die. Buried alive. What a way to go! They weren't so tough. Man, this isn't a very hard game, is it? The difficulty will pick up. Uh-oh. Don't trap yourself. Like I just did. Now if I can get to that alien, I can bury him right away. No way I'm going to be able to reach that one. these aliens can't survive underground, otherwise our plan totally bites. You can't dig up buried aliens again either, they're gone forever. Ah. I will bury you! 
I'm like a medieval Japanese Khrushchev. This takes place in medieval Japan. The best armaments they get is a shovel. Whoa. Can't dig up lanterns either. Oh, come on. Get over here. Run! It's not safe. To this day, I have no idea how those guys are supposed to move. Or what governs their behavior. So I just sort of wing it. Cutscene! Dance! Alien. Anger Kibishi! Do not anger Kibishi. Also, don't correct my spelling or pronunciation of this game. It's a Game Boy game for crying out loud. I'm sorry if I pronounced it wrong, but I don't really need to fix it. I can pronounce it how I want to pronounce it. Uh oh. Get in the boat. Flee to safety. Boat appears in World 3, which is where we are. I used to scream at this game when I was young. I used to say, there are candy bars in the hole. You should go in there. But the game did not hear me. I got very angry at it. Who did this game think it was? Perfectly good candy bars in that hole. Saved by a lantern. Get back over here. Alright. Whoa! Whoa, hey! Calm down. He'll be back. Or not. This game can take a very short amount of time, or a long time. Uh oh. Got eaten. Way to get eaten. Start burying. Eep. Run. Ah, nuts. Game gets sufficiently hard at this point. First two areas, not so much a problem. Now you've got no room to run. Too many aliens. Take this, aliens! Ah! Nuts. Alright, we'll continue this next time, folks. More Hyankyo Alien, coming up.